this video is very different. I don't even know why I'm making it. I was not gonna make this. I actually just accidentally opened my front camera. I saw myself and I was like, bitch, let's make a YouTube video. So I just had a panic attack and um, I don't know when that started. I don't think I ever really had panic attacks growing up. I would have like fits of anxiety kind of where I would be crying and upset, but it was never like panicking. You know what I'm saying? Like it wasn't, it wasn't the same thing because panic attacks and anxiety attacks are definitely different things. And I mean, they go hand in hand, but I've had kind of a couple different incidents where this has happened recently and i'm sorry if this video is like a jumbled mess i'm not going to be smoking just because i feel like i just shouldn't right now given the nature of my mental health and also physical health because i'm just like not feeling 100 percent right now but uh i just want to say this video is not meant to bash weed if you've seen any of my other videos then you know that i am literally the biggest stoner ever and i'm a huge cannabis advocate i stand for cbd i stand for medical marijuana and also just recreational marijuana if you want to fucking smoke weed and you're of age whatever do you boo i don't care so i just want to say like this video is not aiming to make people think weed is this horrible thing I just want to be realistic. I want to be an actual fucking person and like not pretend that weed is always perfect and that it doesn't have any downsides because the reality is sometimes for certain types of people, it doesn't matter if it's because of their mental health or because of their brain chemistry or whatever it is, it just doesn't always work. <laughs> it doesn't always hit you in a way that is calm and peaceful and like chill vibes, you know what I'm saying? Like. Oh God, I'm talking so fast. <laughs> I feel crazy. A lot of the time, weed is great for me, but um, there's been a couple phases in my life where I couldn't smoke the same way because I was going through something. It was making me anxious. Whatever the reason, weed was just exacerbating my problems. And I feel like lately it's kind of made me feel crazy at times where I think I just have to really monitor the types of strains I'm smoking. I used to be like, fuck it, I can smoke anything and I'm good, but I'm just realizing that's not how it is anymore. I've had a couple situations, like if you guys wanna know what just happened, I accidentally inhaled a tiny bit of food. I was chewing trail mix, literally trail mix was the start of all of this. I accidentally inhaled a little bit down the wrong pipe and I started freaking the fuck out. I was really stoned and I don't know what it was, but I, freaked out like i started crying i i was all convinced because it felt weird that i was like gonna die because i inhaled something and i read once that like you can get pneumonia if you inhale food and it just goes into your lungs and i started having like a full-blown panic attack because normally i would just go to the doctor or like wait it out you know because if something really did happen then i could just wait to see my symptoms but i started freaking out because of the whole, you know, situation going on right now, like the pandemic, but me smoking weed right now is causing me to freak out more. It's causing me to get paranoid. It's causing me to get anxious. And it's not weed's fault. It's a result of all these other things happening in the world and like my environment and my brain. But sometimes weed is just gonna make your shit worse. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was feeling fine. I was like, taking it one day at a time. I fucking was looking at apartments this morning, like trying to figure out what I want to do because where am I going to go after this ends? Like I'm trying to move, I'm trying to do all these things. And I was just like, you know what? I'm just going to breathe. I'll be fine. I just need to stay indoors. We're going to let this pass. We're going to look back on this one day and be like, what the fuck? But we're going to be okay. But then I started freaking out because I was like, I can't just go to the doctor easily right now because I don't want to like, you know, get infected. There's no accessible testing. Like what if I have it and I don't know and I'm like a carrier and then I pass it on to my doctor who's like 60 and then they're just like at huge risk because of me. You know what I'm saying? Like I started freaking out over all these things and just going down the list and I had a full blown panic attack and I never used to have that. But now I realize like I start thinking I'm really gonna die. Um, and mine tends to be in result of medical issues. I'm not sure what that is, but weed, it just makes me the biggest hypochondriac sometimes. One thing is wrong with me and I start freaking the fuck out and crying and I just I can't calm down. And then I feel like I'm not breathing normally, but really it's just me panicking. And it's like, I didn't, I never used to have that happen to me until recently and it fucking sucks. Like it literally sucks. 
I wouldn't wish that on anyone because it makes you feel crazy. You don't know if something's actually wrong with you or if you're just panicking and you feel like you're choking because you're panicking. If you've made it this far in the video, I applaud you because <laughs> we're gonna keep talking about how this bitch, she's crazy. Marijuana mermaid, who's she? I don't know her, I'm fucking terrified. Get me out of the ocean, like I'm not swimming anymore. I ain't no mermaid bitch. I'm flopping like a fish on a deck because sometimes weed, I think I know her. I don't know her. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying right now. <laughs> this is making me feel better though, so thank you for that. <laughs> Another time recently, weed made me spiral into this whole bizarre like paranoid mindset i was like what the fuck is this my friends were like in a fight in front of me and it just triggered some kind of response when i was high that made me feel stressed out i don't know exactly what it was i guess it could have been minor ptsd but i'm not trying to diagnose myself but just from my family screaming and stuff when i was really little like it did really freak me out at the time and i think sometimes when i hear people fight like that especially in another room and it's like closed off which was like what would happen when I was little. It just triggers something in me that causes a big anxiety response. So that happened and I was just sitting out here with my friend on the couch and then suddenly I just had this weird response where I didn't want to be around them, like I just wanted to be alone and I started feeling really weird and like they looked weird to me. I felt intimidated and uncomfortable and just off. Like I can't even describe it. And the weed enhanced it so much. I remember taking another hit and it just like set in. I was like, what the fuck? And I asked my friend to leave like in a super nice way. I was like, I'm so sorry, dude. Like, it's not you. Like something's actually wrong with me right now. Like, I just feel like I'm having some kind of really bad anxiety response and I just really need to be alone. And honestly, shout out them because I was being like, <laughs> I was being so weird and they were so understanding. I felt so fucking bad, but I was about to freak out. And then later that night I was home alone and I started freaking out because I thought I heard someone like outside, which was like because the window was open and like it was nighttime, so there wasn't that many noises. So like naturally I hear my neighbors opening doors and stuff. But because I was high, I got all paranoid and panicked. And bitch, I literally, I shut every window, closed everything and locked it, even though I'm on the second story. So like who's like, no one is like grapple hooking up here to like break into my house. like. <laughs> but I was just so high, I was being like so irrational. And this never happens like, I swear guys, this is a new thing. I, if weed made me like this all these years, I would not be smoking weed for a fucking career, okay? By the way, CBD does help. I've been out of CBD tinctures, but I could use that. But yeah, so I'm going around locking every window, like closing all my doors, whatever. And I literally turned off every single light in my entire house because you know when it's dark out and like the light reflects on the window and you can't really see outside. I noticed that and I was like, I need to look out. So I turned off every light and I was like standing on the side, like trying to see if there was like someone outside. Of course there fucking wasn't. I mean like maybe on the street, but like what, what? Anyway, I just needed to get this off my chest. Like I think I'm only going to smoke the strains that I know are okay for me. I'm going to be upping my CBD usage. I'm just gonna be careful. Like if I think I'm in a bad mindset or if I think I'm being paranoid or there's something going on that's gonna trigger my anxiety, I'm not gonna smoke because I just think like this this time right now is causing a lot of struggles for a lot of people and weed sometimes it just makes me feel weird it makes me feel dissociated and it's weird because other times weed is like a blanket or like a hug like literally I get home and I smoke a bowl and I feel so much better but I'm just having a weird time right now but if you are watching this and you are hitting your bong and you're like what is this bitch talking about I literally am so jealous of you because I wish that I I wish I wasn't having these weird responses like if I'm gonna be quarantined in my house for a couple weeks, you know, minimum, I'm trying to be high as fuck, but <laughs> apparently not. It's okay, I'm gonna do something creative, gonna do something good out of this, but I'm gonna try to upload content nonetheless when I'm feeling okay enough to smoke. Thank you for listening. That's that. I'm gonna go take a bath. Bye.